In this video, we're gonna talk about Reese Witherspoon in her show, Big Little Lies. And Reese Witherspoon is aging phenomenally well. She looks like she hasn't aged a day since, you know, her movie Cruel Intentions with Ryan Felipe, which if you're my age, that was like the movie to watch in high school. Anyways, Reese Witherspoon is beautiful and she looks great. And the reason she looks so good is because she's clearly going to someone amazing who is simply maintaining her and preserving her. That's a really great way to look at the skincare, lasers, and injectable treatments as a way to preserve you. Not so much make you look different, but just kind of like tweak, refresh, uplift, soften, and all that good stuff. Reese Witherspoon is a total babe, but I know she's getting the tox, and what I mean by that is neuromodulators like Botoxium and Dysport, because she doesn't have a lot of frown lines. She can't really bring her brows together. She looks really nice and soft. She doesn't really have any crow's feet. And I also definitely think she's getting some dermal fillers because her cheeks look really nice, her lips look great, her jawline looks awesome. And really what someone's done is clearly just helped her look the same and she's not aging a day. But just because people look the same when they're celebrity doesn't mean they're not having procedures. When it looks this good, it just means they're going to somebody really good. Where they don't look different, they're just very much themselves, just preserved and maintained. And that's kind of the goal with all of these rejuvenation procedures, is to have them done in such a way that you don't look like a totally different person. These non-surgical injectable procedures are not intended to create serious augmentations. They're intended to mitigate the signs of aging and maybe just provide little enhancements here and there to bring your facial features into better alignment, proportion, symmetry, things like that. All in all, I think she looks great and I wouldn't be surprised if she's also taking really good care of herself. Her body mass index, her weight looks really good, she looks really fit, her legs look great in her shoes. So I wouldn't be surprised if she's really actively caring for herself on many different levels as well. I love to see Hollywood celebrities aging as well as she does. We can really take note from these people. I don't know about you, but I'm looking forward to pulling a Jane Fonda and looking like I'm 60 when I'm 80. The earlier you start, the better. So if you have any questions about skincare, check out my YouTube playlist on skincare. If you have any other questions, go to rachelvarga.ca. I offer one-on-one -on -one anti-aging consultations. Doesn't matter where you are in the world, this stuff that you can learn with me matters to help you make smarter choices so that you don't purchase products and procedures that are gonna waste your time and money because trust me, they are everywhere. That's why I'm so passionate about bringing this information to you so that you make smarter purchasing decisions and you avoid the gimmicks because you are too smart. So keep me in your back pocket. Follow me at Rachel Varga Official on all platforms. Don't forget I'm on podcast. That one's really cool because that's where I interview uh, health experts from all over the world. I'm actually part of a collaborative and it's it's basically this community of other expert healthcare providers where we come together to serve you guys. Currently we're serving 50 million people all over the world to bring forth wonderful health promoting information and that goal is to provide a billion people information by 2030. So stick with me. I'm getting into some pretty cool big things and I'd love your support. So be sure to subscribe, head on over to rachelvarga.ca, learn with me one-on-one -on -one if you want, and I'll see you in the next video. Bye guys.